This is Twit. Number five is Outlook, which I promised you last week that I would review today. Outlook for iOS is only a few weeks old, but so far it's my pick. Outlook is certainly the best choice for an Exchange Outlook account through Office 365, but it's also great for Outlook.com, Gmail, iCloud, and Yahoo Mail. Outlook for iOS includes features similar to Mailbox that allow you to swipe a message out of your inbox and schedule it to return in a few hours tomorrow morning or the time of your choosing. I also love that, love that it gives you direct access to your calendar and lets you easily attach files from OneDrive, Dropbox, Box, Google Drive, and many other cloud storage accounts. I think my favorite feature of the Outlook app is the focused inbox. It works a lot like Google's priority mail feature, but I think it's even more user friendly. Focus lets you see your most important emails and other lets you see everything else. Now, if you watched last week's episode of iPad Today, you know that there's at least one blogger complaining about security with the app, but those claims are a bit overblown. Now, I personally don't think any email account is really secure. I think we've learned that. And I'm sure that as this app evolves, more security features, more secure features will be added. The new Outlook app is based on the email app Accompli that Microsoft acquired late last year. And, bonus tip, last week I heard that rumors that Microsoft was planning to acquire Sunrise, my favorite iOS calendar app, so I look forward to seeing what they plan to do with that. And I hope it involves holograms.